We've come here to Kersfield Farm near Swinton in Berwickshire to have a look at the ground source heat pump which they use for grain drying and for heating some buildings. The system draws its heat from the fields behind me here. There's two loops, uh, ground loops, one in this field, one over the hedge in the other field. In total they cover about five acres and they draw the heat from there to take it towards the heat pump. Okay, we're now back in at the grain store and we have two uh, heat pump units here which use a refrigeration cycle to upgrade the low grade heat that has been collected from the field. Uh, and I'm going to ask Shane from Calibrate to just explain his system. Uh, so in simplistic forms we take the low grade energy like you've just said Jim from the field and we use a vacant vapour compression cycle which is in, a, in the essence a refrigeration cycle mm -hmm. to take it from low grade energy only sort of 8 to 10 degrees and up to usable energy sort of 40 to 50 degrees and that's done very efficiently. Heat for the grain dryer was previously supplied by a gas burner which is behind the wall here. We've now got this large heat exchanger installed uh, so that the intake air to the, the dryer is drawn through the heat exchanger. The hot water from the heat pumps heats this heat exchanger up to around 50 degrees and any excess is still provided by the gas burner. So the, the saving in fuel from the gas burner is the main advantage of this system. So we've had a look at the, the heat pump system installed here at Kersfield. Uh, one of the benefits is that you can also get a chilling effect. It's not just used for heat, we can also get a chilling effect from the system. Uh, what other sort of agricultural applications have you you've used them in? Um, so we're using them in uh, dairy farms, so we're snap chilling the milk. So for instance we're heating the parlour and heating the hot water and then we're snap chilling the milk from 34 down to 4 degrees before it hits the vat for free basically. Uh, potato farms we're doing as well, whereby we're you know doing drying of bedding, we're heating workshops etc and then we're chilling down the potato stores for free. Um, so really it's endless really, if you've got a high cooling load or a high heating load, this sort of technology fits in perfectly and it's, um, it's very hands off, you don't have to do anything, you just pretty much put it in, if it's been commissioned correctly it just runs, mm. so um, that's what's so good about it really. Mm.